Hello everyone. First of all, let me say thank you for checking out the blog today. The intention behind this blog is to serve you and, and to let you know what God is doing in our church so that we can better connect with what God is doing in your home. Ultimately, I believe through the biblical witness that we are stronger together in raising the next generation of faith, that it takes both. In fact, this Wednesday, we're going to be talking through a very popular passage called the Shema. It's in Deuteronomy chapter 6, verses 4 through 9, and in it, there's a very important command. In fact, Jesus would say that this is the most important command in all of Scripture. It is to love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your strength. But the passage begins with God through Moses commanding the people saying, Hear, O Israel. In other words, this was a command for everyone, that everyone was to love God with everything that they have. And that not only were they to love God, and not only was it to be a personal faith, but it was to multiply in the lives of the next generation. It goes on to say that you are to impress these things on your children. And so the raising up of the next generation of faith is going to take everyone. And that's why I'm excited about your prayers and your support. And I can report to you that already this summer, God has done some great things through our students. We started the summer with our summer send camp, where our students served in Citronelle and got to see God work through their lives personally to impact an entire community. But also God worked through them um, individually and worked in them and um, showed them His grace and led them to a deeper sense of discipleship. And some of them transformed lives for the first time. So exciting things are happening. And I believe that God is going to continue to do exciting things. God has built a great foundation here the last few years at North Mobile and especially in our student ministry. And as the student pastor, I'm so excited about the future. But let me encourage you to not uh, stop praying. You need to continue to pray for us and what God is doing. Ultimately, that's the fuel that keeps us going and leads us to exactly what God wants to do through us. And, and let me encourage you to do one other thing, and that is to pray about joining our team and being a part of um, our relationship team, where on Sunday mornings and Wednesday nights, you're actually a part of what we're doing and you're seeing faces and, and students are seeing you and, and relationships are being formed because through relationships, discipleship, happens. And so pray about that. And then let me just let you know that there are going to be three opportunities for you this summer. Um, and really to be a leader in our ministry, it's going to take you going through all three of those opportunities. The first one is just to check out what we're doing. And so that's to come and be a part of a Sunday morning or Wednesday night. We want to make sure that if God's leading you in this direction, that you get a, a genuine feel for what we're doing so that you don't walk into something unexpected, but that you have a great idea of what God is doing. And so you can do that throughout the next month and a half. You can contact our office. You can contact Dave or myself or Cliff, and, and we'll set you up with an opportunity to sit in on a class or be a part of worship on Wednesday nights. And then following your your stay in our student ministry, those couple weeks of visitation, what we're going to do is the second thing, and that's to set up an interview with you. So you'll meet with either myself or somebody else on the student ministry team, and we'll talk through what God's doing in your heart, what God's doing in our ministry, and we'll try to put you in the best possible place for you to serve. And of course, you're going to have a great idea of where that is as well. And then the third thing that we're going to do as a part of our leadership training is, a, is what we call boot camp. That's our main training mechanism for discipleship here at North Mobile. That's going to be on August 9th. It'll follow church. In fact, it'll be starting at 2 o'clock. And um, you'll be trained in exactly how we do student ministry. How do we teach? How do we build relationships? Because ultimately, what we're doing is very simple. We're building relationships with students, and we're helping them take the next step spiritually. And so pray about these opportunities. I, I think it's, it's time for us to to just encourage people to get off the sidelines, get on the field, and be a part of a winning team. And there is no better team to be a part of than one that impacts students' lives in this life and in the life to come. And so encourage you, pray, and think about joining our team. We'd love to have you check us out.